Welcome to the perfect Southampton waterfront getaway at the Long Island shore, where families share mesmerizing sunsets at the heated pool and memorable moments at the beach and fireplace. Hi, my name is Oscar and I'm your host. It is a great pleasure for me to give you a grand tour of this magnificent 6,000 feet mansion built on a one acre property. It has six bedrooms with six and a half bathrooms a perfect getaway for your family and friends. This fully furnished and equipped getaway is also packed with entertainment and not only for a rainy day, a morning workout in the fitness room, playing pool in the afternoon or having a romantic evening with a bottle of wine from the region in front of a fireplace. Please come inside and let me show you what this beautiful place is all about. In the lobby, we have this beautiful Italian crystal chandelier. First, we're going to the second floor. On the second floor, we have the kitchen, dining room, king's master bedroom, a living room, bathroom, and most important, a fabulous view of the pool, wetlands, and the bay. The kitchen is fully equipped, including a wine and beverage refrigerator. It's a great place for the family and friends gathering and watching the chef preparing your favorite meals. The kitchen is also wheelchair accessible. The dining room can seat up to 10 people with access to the barbecue on the deck and additional seating overlooking the wetlands and the bay. Now we are entering the living room, equipped with a high-definition TV and sound system, a cozy fireplace, and it is decorated with designer furniture. It has direct access to the deck, with a stunning view of the bay. This is the King's Master bedroom with a fireplace. The room is overlooking the deck and the bay. The bathroom has a large vanity counter with his and her sinks, a jacuzzi, a spacious shower and a huge walk-in closet. Outside the King's Master bedroom on the deck is a seating area a perfect place to enjoy your breakfast or read the morning newspaper with a cup of coffee or tea overlooking the bay. There is also a guest bathroom in the hallway. And now we are going to the first floor. On my left are three bedrooms. This is the white bedroom with a full bathroom and a closet. Right next to it is the orange bedroom. It has a full bathroom and a closet. The ivory bedroom has a full bathroom and a walk-in closet. The room has a view of the pool and the bay. Across the hall is the blue master bedroom with a walk-in closet and a full bathroom. Right outside from the bedroom on the balcony is a seating area with a view of the pool and the bay. The black master bedroom has a computer with internet access, a full bathroom, and a closet. The living room has designer's furniture, high-definition TV and sound system, a fireplace, and direct access to the pool and the bay. In the backyard is a private seating area with a table and umbrella. It has sunbathing lounge chairs at the pool overlooking the wetlands and the bay. 
Before I show you the basement, let me show you the laundry room with the washer and dryer. And now, let me show you what's in the basement. One of the great advantages of this building is the elevator, which gives easy access to people with disabilities. The fitness room has a treadmill, yoga mats, a training ball, a state-of-the-art tough stuff workout machine, and a sound system. It also has its own bathroom. Right next to the fitness room is the entertainment room with the bar stools and high tables. It is equipped with TV screens, sound system and the pool table that can easily turn into a ping pong table and a fireplace. In the garage are three bicycles for scouting out the local area. The paddles and life vests are stored here for kayaking in the bay. Well, as you can see, I've changed into something more comfortable and I'm ready to show you where we are hiding our kayak. Now we are in the wetlands, that's where we hide our kayak, but this is a secret so don't tell anyone. So when you go kayaking, make sure you got your life vests and paddles, cause I'm only gonna show you where a kayak is hidden. Now that we found it, it's time to go for a ride in the bay for some kayaking. After I showed you the house, my friend Ming is taking us to the Southampton village. Now we are entering the Southampton village with its cute shops only about 3 miles from the mansion. This is where all the locals and visitors come for shopping. And who knows, you may run into some celebrities. The Southampton village offers fashion designers, coffee shops, restaurants and fine cigars. But if you don't feel like shopping, Southampton is also known for its international film festival, galleries, antiquing, polo, golf, concerts in the park, fishing, wine tasting, organic markets, art and craft fairs, and the Southampton Historical Museum. And now that you got a taste of the Southampton village, it's time to go to the number one beach in America, which is the Cooper Beach. No matter what the season is, the Cooper Beach is always a main attraction. You can come here by car, biking, or even walking. It's only about two miles from the mansion. This concludes our Southampton Mansion Getaway Tour. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you at the mansion. Ciao!